I'm Raven Center Matt Burke. Marylanders are voting on the definition of marriage this November, but changing the definition has consequences and you're not being given all the facts when you read the brief language on the ballot. If the referendum is not voted down, our religious freedoms are at risk. Churches, hospitals, religious charities, private businesses and individuals all will be subject to lawsuits and harassments for openly expressing their religious beliefs. The ballot says that religious organizations don't have to provide goods and services in violation of their religious beliefs. Not true. The ballot does not include a provision in the actual law stating that exemptions regarding services do not apply if a particular program or service receives state or federal funds. What happens to our churches and our ministries then? Under the new law, churches, religious organizations, and charities that help the government care for those in need would not be exempt and would lose their First Amendment rights. And there are no provisions protecting businesses and individuals. Marylanders should not be fooled into thinking we can redefine marriage and still protect our religious liberties. Don't redefine marriage. Vote against question six.